done to you? What have they done to you? It's all right, it's me, Angela. Put the light on. Thought I'd wait for you in the hall. I said, put the light on. I could have injured you with this. Where's Sir Jumpy? Well, you are a burglar. How did you get in? If I were you, I'd get Malcolm and his techies to up your security. Malcolm is still at Thames House. Maybe. We'll set him a test. Get him to upgrade and see if I can still get in. What do you want? You've forgotten the date, haven't you? Oh, no. I'm so sorry. Peter killed himself a year ago tomorrow. Oh, Angela. I wanted to marry him, you know. I proposed to him after they fired him from the Royal Protection Unit. I thought you broke up after that. I pretended to. It was his idea to protect my career in MI5. What did he say? No. We saw each other, though. Like spy lovers avoiding the spies. Why didn't you help him, Ruth? What could I do? You know how tight they are about royal protection. You were his sister. Stepsister. You were in GCHQ. You were at the nerve centre. You could have helped him. He was protecting Princess Diana. When they found out how bad his drinking was, they fired him. He couldn't go on being near her. They fired him because he found out about the plot. What plot? The plan by the security services to assassinate Diana. Which succeeded. That is insane. You know it is. Peter was fired on the 1st of August, 1997. On the 31st of August, they killed her. The nation's heart. No. It was a car crash, an accident. No. It was murder, and I can prove it. You need to get an MD viewer. Well, actually... Bring work home, do you? When did you get that done? Undercover with the INLA in 92. It's a great operation. The Contingent Events Committee. This is a no-eyes document. It's meant to be destroyed in the room after it's read. How did you get hold of it? It was in Peter's things. How did he get it? From Diana herself, of course. And how did she get it? She was a very clever woman. Angela, you could go to jail for having this. <laughs> Why do you think I microfilmed it and hid it in my tooth? It's not funny. Read the next page.
I've never heard of the Contingent Events Committee. Of course you haven't. File number 954396G130497. The last six numbers must be the date, 13th of April, 1997. You can start by looking to see if Harry's diary for then still exists. Can start what? Our investigation. We've got to get details of how they organised the crash in Paris and murdered her. This is just one more crackpot conspiracy theory. Think, Ruth. A no-eyes document. The security forces killed the people's princess. It's the greatest scandal of the age. Your brother killed himself because he couldn't prove it. You can, and you want to. I know you do. Stop it. Stop it. Do it for Peter. No. Then do it for the country. It's madness. All right. I'll go. But I know the spook inside you is saying, what if? What if, Ruth? Home time soon. Do you fancy a drink? Oh, uh, don't know, maybe. You seem a bit down today. Eyes. Oh, funny throat. You want a Lizzie? No, no, I'm, I'm fine. I'm going to send these back to registry. You done with that one? Not quite, no. I'm not a whiff. He comes to the George tonight? Yes, please. Ruth? What? Uh, George, tonight. Uh, no. Uh, Adam? Yes, Ruth? I am... Um... No, it doesn't matter. I, I just came across something. Have you heard of the Contingent Events Committee? Can't say that I have. What is it? That's what I was going to ask you. Could be clandestine. You mean attached to anti-terrorism? I don't know. Anti-terrorism subcommittees are top secret, but they're listed. Ask Harry. He loves clandestine. Yeah. But don't mention it to him. I mean, you know, I'll, I'll talk to him. There's no need for you to. What's the matter? Nothing. Isn't that... Hello, everyone. I've got a special treat for you. Angela Wells. Oh, God. Miss Wells! Safa Eunice, field officer. Very, very pleased to meet you. And are you, Mr. Eunice? Yeah, and this is Joe Portman, junior field officer. Joe. I'm really glad to meet you. I mean, you're a legend, am I? <laughs> Sweet of you to say so. Miss Wells, we've never met Adam Carter, intelligence officer.